All right, Revelation chapter 18, I'm going to start at verse 1. It says, and after these things, I saw another angel. So like, hold on. All right, it says, and after these things, I saw another angel come down from heaven, having great power, and the earth was lightened with his glory. And he cried mightily with a strong voice, saying, Babylon, which is America, the great is fallen, is fallen, and has become the habitation of devils, and hold of every, of every foul spirit in a cage of every unclean and hateful bird. All right? So you're going to have these different desert animals living here when this time comes. All right? And guess what? All you people that are going to take that chip are going to be destroyed in that nuclear destruction when it does come. And I'm going to read that real quick and get one more scripture. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 14, starting at verse 9. And the third angel, and this trip is going to be made mandatory, man. You know? So, before I read that, all right, let me get this since I said that. Because this trip is going to be made mandatory, all right? And we are not to take it. This is Acts, chapter 5, verse 29. Then Peter and the other apostles answered and said, We ought to obey Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai rather than men. All right, so we ought to obey the Lord. The Lord don't want us to take this chip, okay? Nor, did, nor, this, nor any of these shots, if you know what I'm talking about, these punches that E pushes out, all right? But, you know, the MOTB is the chip, all right? The MICRO chip, all right? And um, we're not to take it, man, okay? So let me read the scripture again. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 14, verse 9. It says, And the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, if any man worship the beast in his image and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand, the same, that's saying, so if you take this chip anywhere, anywhere on your body at all, even if you take it and try to take it back out of you, you're still going to be destroyed. And, here, and it says it right here, verse 10, the same, the same person that took it, shall, took that chip, shall drink of the wine of the wrath of Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai, which is poured out without mixture into the cup of his indignation, and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb. All right? So, you take that chip, you're going to be destroyed by nuclear missiles, man. All right? And that's just... There's no repentance for taking the chip. All right? doesn't matter... Your, 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 your church pastor, if, if, he, if he all of a sudden finds out that the MOTB is the chip, you know, he finds out people took it and then tries to sell, sell them this repentance, no. All right? But um, let me get this one more scripture. All right? And, and, and what's that fire that there was, that was, what's that fire um, in Revelation 14 that we were just reading? What's that fire and brimstone they're going to be tormented with? You know? That's the nuclear missiles, man. All right. This is Zechariah. This is the last scripture I'm going to get right now. This is Zechariah chapter 14, verse 12. And this shall be the plague wherewith Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah will smite all the people that have fought against Jerusalem. Their, fl their flesh shall consume away while they stand upon their feet. So, right while you're standing on your feet, it's, your flesh is going to burn right off of you, man. And that nuclear fire. It says, and their eyes shall go some away in their holes. You see, now the scripture is getting, you know, it, 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 it should be painting a picture in your head, you know? People's eyes are going to, you know, their eyes, eyeballs are going to burn up in a way, right in their eye sockets, man. That nuclear fire. It says, and their tongue shall go some away in their mouth. What do you think that one means? Tongue is going to burn up right away in their mouth, man. All right? And this is going to happen. All right? As for the elect, that remnant, they will get delivered, all right? They are going to be delivered out of here. They will not have to taste of this. You know, they're actually going to be, and they're going to be in a chariot, all right? Because the Lord is going to come back and beam them up. Um, Revelation chapter 11 and verse 12. And they, heard, and they, talking about the elect, heard a great voice from heaven saying unto them, Come up hither, as them getting beamed up. All right, into the chariot. It says, and they ascended up to heaven in a cloud. That cloud is the chariot, which, chari which chariots are so-called UFOs. 
All right, it says, and their enemies beheld them. Verse 13, in the same hour was a great earthquake, which is what? That nuclear destruction. Let me get the precept for it. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 24, and verse 20. The earth shall reel, which reel means to shake to and fro like a drunkard. All right, and the nuclear missiles are going to cause the earth to quake. Okay, it says, and shall be removed like a cottage, and the transgression thereof shall be heavy upon it, and it shall fall and not rise again. All right, so back in Revelation 11. And 13, it says, in the same hour was there a great earthquake. It was that nuclear destruction, and the tenth part of the city fell, and in the earthquake, in the nuclear destruction, were slain of men 7,000, which 7,000 means completion. So in the nuclear destruction, you know, pretty much everyone that's going to be, if it, when the missiles hit, anyone that's standing on the soils of America will be destroyed. You're not going to have any scragglers hanging around, someone that are coming out of rock a couple of years later. No. It says, and in the earthquake were slain of men 7,000. In the nuclear destruction, pretty much everyone going to die. All right? It says, and the remnant were affrighted and gave glory to the power of heaven. Okay? But, yeah, the, by, the, by, that, by that time the nuclear missiles hit, the, the elect, they're going to be in a chariot. All right? With the new bodies and changed bodies, man. All right? So, yeah, nuclear, nuclear destruction is coming. Okay? Regardless of what Putin says, all right, if anybody else would say otherwise, man, nuclear destruction is coming. You know, so with that, I'm going to give all the praises, honor, and glory to who rightfully belongs, which is Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakhakadash, double honor to the elders and apostles, a great millstone, never well. Peace, blessings, and salutations to the elect. Peace, which in the Hebrew is Shalom, so Shalom to the elect.